Matt, uh, Matt Ponton. Is it like, so there's a lot of like, in a bunch of Maryland games, there's a lot of hidden Leaf players in the village that are really good at all the games, but they just don't come out. And oh. Dante's definitely one of them. Oh yeah, like when he can, he can make it up. Right. Uh, Looks like um, Matt's trying to keep his offensive pressure, but, ooh, no throw. Oh, there's a throw, no reset though. This match seems interesting. Seems like Kokoro. Seven K launch. Yeah, seems like Kokoro can definitely like dictate the pace just because of her frames. But sh oh, <laughs> but have that's that's something you don't want to do, especially not in a small ring like this. Bass right. will kill you if you decide to hold. I can't. That's, that's actually crazy. But that's that makes sense for a grappler archetype, you know. Yeah, and during that pickup throw, he can 50-50 throw, and that throw that he just did was an offensive hold. Is now, offensive dead? holds are used to people who are going to attack. Great mid hold by Dante. Uh, good block on that low. People oh, start side break, sidestep attack. Apparently the sidesteps got buffed in this game, correct? Uh, yes. They now have full invulnerability okay. versus any attack that's just linear. You ah. can use your fatal, the beginning of Fatal Rush, or you can use any move or string with tracking. In gotcha, middle. that's pretty cool. Another pickup reset throw. Is he gonna go for a regular throw? Fatal Rush. Nice launch. No break blow from Matt. Wake up, wake up kick. Oh. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, yeah, that throw does damage. <laughs> I thought it was pretty funny when I found that out the first time. Yeah, it's so cool. But Matt will be taking this first match. Yeah. And leaving the score with 1-0 in Matt's favor. Seems like in this game, the ca the faster characters have the neutral advantage, but the but the grappler characters have the Oki advantage. Uh, funny thing you say that, that because even though you have a faster character, it can be like now because sidestep attack has been buffed. Right. Any character can easily pick back up offense with good, with good movement. Yes, that especially with good movement. Gotcha, gotcha. That's pretty. And cool. It looks like he's opting for a stage change now. Yeah. Or just giving himself time to think about what happened right, last right, match. Right. Yeah, this game is. I, I I really hope people give this game the the chance it deserves, you know. And people should because yeah. you know it's a different formula. Yes, a lot, I get that a lot of people don't like having to be forced into a decision making process, right, but you right. got to do that with every game. Yeah, but it's heavily implied in this game. Yeah, this game is just it's just like in the open, you know. And it's like and you can get killed for your mistakes in this game, right. just as much as any other game as well. Yeah, this game has you still the, have the space. Yes, it's not. A mash fest at all. This game has OD conditioning, and it's a very Yomi based game. Yes. Wow, they did a lot of damage with a high counter. Throw. No low hold on the wake up kick. Actually, a funny thing about that is that if you do low holds at that certain range, uh -huh. is that uh, you can actually catch it. Oh wow. Mid wake up kicks have a uh, shorter range than the low wake up kicks. Oh, that's actually interesting. I didn't know that. Yeah. Guess oh, the... just a little short in the juggle. Ca drop caused by the slope. Ooh, no throw punish on. I was happy he got the uh, the raptor launch. That's kind of confusing. The, the getting the launch off the raptor or the continuing the juggle off the raptor. Uh yeah, like uh, I think a lot of people are still trying to figure out their uh, staple juggle for that. Right. And he might be going for another reset throw. No, no dice on it. Okay. Finishes the string. Uh oh, that was unfortunate. I think he was trying to go for a launch instead, but there was a wall there. Oh, no finish on the throw. He could have got a lot of damage from it. Back to this nice spacing game. This is spacing you were talking about earlier. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, like, like all it takes is that one thing. Yeah, and also, like you, were, like you were talking about, he guessed wrong on the uh, hold, and he died for it. You know? Yeah. Back Again, this. pacing back and forth. Yeah. It's going to come in. Oh, my goodness. Running throw. And I believe that's not an offensive hold as well. 7K, good punish. Any is grappler. Is oh, this is gonna hurt. That's the one. Damage is because of the way they. they I guess they kind of simplified the game in a sense. Damage seems very uh, a lot higher. Uh, the damage definitely is higher this time around. Interesting. Ooh, back That's to so again. Well, very risky decision. Yeah. Good read. Matt just sitting on his lead. That's actually interesting, you know, the keep out throw in a sense. You know, run a block is, is usually yeah, when you keep, keep yeah, out with keep out with a button, right? Yeah, you can uh, you can keep out with buttons or you can keep out with the throw. Now the great thing about this is that if you know that someone's gonna throw, uh -huh. you can use your faster throw just in case. Because even if you don't get your neutral throw, neutral throws can be broken. Gotcha, gotcha, you, gotcha. You, got you still get your high counter damage. Or sorry, not high counter, you get your counter throw damage. Gotcha, you, gotcha. You. But also, in this game, I um, 
when I was playing Matt earlier, he also mentioned that you cannot break throws with HPK presets anymore. Interesting. You have to press the throw button. That's actually pretty cool. And it looks like Matt will be taking this game as well. Score is 2-0. Dante's got to put something on the board. Things are not looking too good for him right now. Not at all. Matt looking to take this kind of convincingly. What I want to what I want to see from Dante is that he needs he needs to force Matt into making a decision, unless where he's going to switch to Lisa now. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Didn't he play Lisa? Was he a Lisa main in Vi? Uh, he played a bunch of characters. Okay. But I think he's uh primarily a Lisa main now. Okay. The cool thing about this game is the, is the the complexity is not in the characters, but in the in the playing a, another opponent. Playing itself. in the triangle. Yeah. yeah. Playing in the triangle system itself. Right. And you want to take advantage of what your opponent uses in the triangle system and use it against them. Right, right, right. That's where the conditioning factor comes in. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So it seems like maybe Lisa has something that uh, Kokoro doesn't that maybe he might be able to take uh, advantage of? Or? Lisa has a reverse stance, kind okay. of similar to characters like Ayane, Helena, and Brad. Got you. And uh, let's see how he does with the altered mix up potential of Lisa. Because <laughs> I know, I know, Matt, right. he's probably not going to be ready for this Lisa, but we'll see how he does. This character seems like I don't know if you ever played Virtual Fighter, but it seems like El Blades from Virtual Fighter. Oh, Fatal Stun! Up, oh, he's going to find a wall. Oh, a wow. obstacle into a break hold. great break hold. Oh, the drop kick, drop a kick. But now he has no meter, so he can't make a mistake anymore. Nice. He spends his meter for. For the damage, wow! Knocks the mask off. Uh, and oh, he, oh, nice, nice what? Step. He actually went for it. I mean, why not, right? Uh oh, nice. High oh, good read on the side step. That's gonna hurt a lot. That's not as much as I thought it would do, but still, definitely a lot. If anyone's <laughs> wake up, wake up. Is that just 5k? That is uh 3k, I believe. 3k, okay. Wake up 3k. Uh oh, wow, nice low. Hole. I think yeah. he was trying to go for something else. Ooh, he's gonna get the wall splat with this probably. Oh, nope, but he misses the chain throw and put. Get up. Reset throw. Offensive hold, he should have thrown! This is gonna hurt a lot. And it's gonna potentially get the um the pushback from the crowd. Oh, nope. Oh, no. Gets Doesn't a wall get instead. He misses. was very close though. Yeah, misses the low, miss times the low. Look at that backdash out. Good spacing in that 7k. Nice side step. step, good, good punish. Point. Again, creating space for himself. Matt being patient. Yeah, patient, but the interesting thing about that is, interesting about that is, as Dante is letting him stay on the ground, and uh, time is not on his side. Oh yeah, of nice. course. Nice, 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 nice uh, adjustment by uh, by Dante. Uh oh, nice launch. Oh, Back combo. I don't think we he was ready for that. This, this is also going to hurt a lot too. Jeez. But now you now Matt is left with no meter. Dante can still make things happen, but he's got to adjust too. Right, exactly. Okay. It's oh, his turn now. Oh, no wall splat. Tries to go for the hold. Doesn't get anything. Nice. Oh, the butt slam. No, I'm, I'm starting to notice that Matt is uh, getting a little cornered here too. Yeah. Jeez, gets up. Reset what's, throw. What's the mix he's probably here? going to go for it. Yep. Another strike. 7k. That also crushes highs, if I believe. Oh, gets him with the rank throw. Good throw. Recovery. Not much he's got to do. Oh, one this. turn. 3k again. Yeet. Sparta! Got the boot. Nice. Oop. Oh, he's gonna find another wall. Wall splat. Nope. Oh, gets the, the homie. Push back. The homie assist. Uh, to couldn't hold. do anything with it, unfortunately. Great launch. Can't capitalize much off of it because of the odd launch height. Right. Oh, Wait, that was okay. ooh, probably not the best decision in the world. Nice. Oh, and there you got. There you go. There you have it. Good stuff in that ponton. Clean 3-0 in favor of Matt. Bass himself takes Xanadu. 